the Tim Maloney Handicap Chase, race 27, a three mile four furlong long to went 20 handicap, number one Timothy Dalton, two Tango Orange Kevin Mean, and three Ashton James Forrest, four Hillbilly Boy for Dave Robinson, five Tills with Glen Boy for Obi One, six Holding Yourself for Aaron Thompson, seven Malta Benny for Molly, it's Surfer, eight Tara's Man for Alex Cherry, nine Derry Lavoir for Martin Leedham, ten High Figurine Obi One, eleven All Gate Cap for Carl Arroganti, and twelfth, twelve, sorry, his fifth marriage for Alex Cherry. Starters have got them lined up and they're off. Tim Maloney, a jockey from back in the 30s. I think he was uh, five times even more as champion jockey. He was an Irishman in the days of people like Dick Francis and Fred Winter. Not that probably any of us remember the 30s. But I suppose we could ask our parents and they probably would tell us about these people. Most people think Dick Francis was just a writer and he wasn't. He was a jockey way, way back. But anyway, back to this race. And it's all gate cap. That's got a seven length advantage from Timothy Dalton, Tyra's man, Ashton Moulton, Boat, Malta Benny against the fence, Tango Orange, but mid pack, then holding your soul. And then the yellow silks and tools with Glen Boy and High Figurine. Inside of those is Hillbilly Boy, Derry Lavoie, and Fifth Marriage. We go a third of 21 fences here. It's three miles and four furlongs. Plenty of long distance races this week. Most of them, Martin's managed to just pick up two milers and six furlongs on the flat, but it's all gate and cat that leads us. These are all very personal jokes on these commentaries amongst us commentators. The only person that will be cringing will be Martin, but it's all gate cat that leads by about five to Ashton and Timothy Dalton. We're almost getting ourselves Indian file as normal. And it's all gate cat from Ashton, Timothy Dalton, Walter Benny, Tango Orange, holding your soul mid pack. The fence at White Tara's man, along with Tills with Glen Worley's inside. And then links back to Derry Lavoie. This marriage is alongside him and the little Billy Boy at the rear. I'll say, boy, squeal like a piggy. No, I'm sure Doug did that earlier. Great film, no deliverance. If we go over the fifth, we're still on the feet. All gate cap by three to Ashton. Side. And then the other silks of high figurine tools with Glen Boy together. And then it's back to Derry Lavoie and Fifth Marriage, and I can't see Hill Billy Boy anymore. He seems to be, uh, I can't even see his shadow. So he's obviously uh, a fair few lengths back. There's still plenty of running here if he's still there. We go over the seventh. Still no sign of Hill Billy Boy. He's gone off into the heels. I'll say, you boy. Open ditch. Oh, we've lost one there. Monto Benny went. Shipped his jockey. Unlucky Molliots. Oh, and there's Hillbilly Boy. David Robinson just at the rear. Even being beaten by the riderless horse. But it's all gate cap. Swings round left handed now. Here at Hedock. We'll come up alongside the judges. Grandstand. We'll get over the ninth. And he'll be the boys finally in front of one. It just happens to be the riderless Morto Benny. But at least he's not uh, psychologically the horse doesn't think he's last anymore. Oh, when they go to the tenth, we lost one there. Hole in your soul's gone. So a couple of top trainers out of the race. Found up Darren Thompson there. We're down two, but we've been through uh, ten, so not unusual. The conditions are pretty heavy here, I think. It's been raining overnight. Oh, and another one's gone. Tills with Glen Boys a faller there. Nasty fall as he came down. Horse on top of jockey, jockey on top of horse. It's kind of a roll reversal thing when they fall. I suppose the horse thinks like, well, you're on top of me, let me be on top of you. So they will go over the twelfth. The ones that are remaining are still standing. I'm going to go off for another circuit. As we go past the winning post, and it's all good cap Timothy Dorton. By four to Ashton with a Tara's man and Tango Orange. High figurine of fifth marriage and Derry Lavoie. And then length also back to Tower there, boy, Hillbilly. But he'll be happy there. Swing off out left handed again.
again to the back straight. Great fences to jump. front as we get down to the six, we go over another open ditch, which is the 17th, it's all gate counter, a little bit of pressure now, being pushed along five and a half furlongs from home, Ashton just sitting on his haunches, looking comfortable, and then a couple of lengths back to Timothy Dalton, fifth marriage and Tara's man, then a further two to the running on now, heel Billy Boy, high figurine, Tango Orange and Derry Lavoie is going out wide, but up front still, it's all gate cap from Ashton, Tara's man running on best of all, they get over the 18th, there's half a mile left to travel, Timothy Dawson jumped that one well, but it takes a hold again, but up front, all gate Cat and Ashton will fight it out as they approach the next with three and a half furlongs to go, it's all gate Cat and Ashton, Ashton, all gate Cat jumps it better, they're over the 19th, there's only two left to jump, now Ashton comes back on the flat, inside the three, and it's Ashton from all gate Cat, and it's Ashton that's starting to pull away here, I'm not sure that anyone's going to be able to run this down, but there's still a couple of furlongs to go, and it's Ashton from all gate Cat's got Never give. Timothy Lawton not sure what he's doing that jock, inside the two it's Ashton but here comes Timothy Dalton, the top weight, here comes the class class rises above everybody else even if you're carrying 12 starting in the handicap and Fern still to run this one to Timothy Dalton to the bag he gets over the last oh, bar a disaster which is not going to happen and Timothy Dalton Paul Rhodes had a crack at Paul for nipping down into a real low-rated handicap and winning that superbly. Second was Ashton, third was I think uh, I wasn't taking much notice of anything else. My apologies. I don't think we lost anybody else and we lost High Figurine as well. He's a faller later on. But Timothy Dalton for Paul Rhodes takes that. Second was Ashton for James Follis. Third was Allgate Cap for Carla Arganti. Fourth was Hillbilly Boy for Dave Robertson. Fifth was Fifth Marriage for Alex Jerry. And yeah, I have to have a dig at Paul coming down into another... 0 to 120 and picking it up. Leave some races for us. 